Hey guys, it's Josh, and welcome to another segment of Building Crate. And you can see the mountain's done, but today's segment, I'm going to be showing you the interior, which a lot has been done to this interior. So I'll give you a closer look after uh, I show you guys briefly what I've done with the wall and the door. The door is functioning, and I've sealed the top so that there's no gaps anymore. And I can lift the entire door and put it down because now the friction gears are 100% working as you can see they actually roll now and the whole wall is secured in place now what I've got here is the behind the cliff section uh, I've added the fuel canisters and this whole setup looks pretty nice to me but obviously the most important thing of the segment I'm going to show you are these trenches which I've made using the dark red slopes and the uh, gray pieces to create this tiled area above. I did consider at one stage having the entire uh, trench section covered with a base plate and then I thought it was such a great design for the uh, maroon rocks and they end up having a great look so I didn't want to uh, conceal that too much but as you can see I still have filler bricks showing because it's not complete yet. Uh, I still need to order more slopes, but it will be done in the near future. This ladder up here is going to be the support beam for the top section that will be ultimately put on the very end. And there's my resistance transport you can see. Uh, and these are all the crates, haha, <laughs> no pun intended, to be loaded onto the transport, which I have uh, set up on this tiled area here so I'm happy with how this turned out I like the irregularity but most of it will be covered up by the transport anyways I've also added a little bit of stuff back there I've shifted the setup a bit lots of filler bricks as you can see and I have this build which I'm gonna place right here this is the uh, like the rebel utilitarian stuff got the ladder and then the vehicle at the back is also my own build so that'll be parked there and I'm still sorting things out but as of now that's the progress within the base and I'm gonna be doing a lot of work on the back there for the, the next couple of days um, but because it's Chinese New Year and I don't know if you guys know this but I'm from Hong Kong uh, uh, my Lego stores are all closed for the next couple of days so I'll be going uh, to use I I'm going to use my own pieces to build the rear section and kind of build the uh, command center over there but uh, that's for another time with that said guys this is pretty much the conclusion of this segment of the building crate series uh, finally I'll just show you guys the rock work I've done over here I've implemented some translucent red for the crystalline structures and uh, that's pretty much it so I'll be keeping these segments pretty brief because I want to save more for the final showcase video and possibly another uh, the design of crate video which uh, I did something similar with on Starkiller base so if you guys like this video don't forget to leave a thumbs up and tell me what you think in the comments below I'll be checking your guys comments and subscribe if you haven't already to catch up on the new segments that will be coming very soon you can also follow me at Legological on Instagram for these behind the scenes photos that I post regularly and I'll see you guys in the next segment